So, welcome to Hot Few Round 2. Uh, we have with us today Isaiah Torres, who is on sabbatical right now, but he is a Southern student and also a TV club member. As you see, he's wearing one of our shirts. I'm Dawn Clevens, of course, and uh, yeah, welcome to Hot Few. Um, Good to be here. Hot wings, even hotter guests, and we... Um, are gonna gonna ask you some questions now. We have these nice wings here. Uh, so before I get going, um, why don't you why don't you give us a little introduction about you specifically towards spicy food? Like how do you handle your spicy food normally? So I've been trying to handle spice. Um, I'm Hispanic, you know. So like you would think that that's like you know like oh he's got you know a little spice in his palate. Yeah, but... if you were racist. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, no, um, no, so I, I eat peppers and, like, hot peppers and stuff like that, but it's always used as, like, a seasoning to add flavor, but I have a feeling that yeah, these, these, are, these are more about, these are more about the spice yeah, than it these is have about been the doused. chicken. These have been doused, so, and, um, <laughs> if um, you taste any chicken in here, good for you. <laughs> good for you is what I'm gonna say. Um... So, uh, yeah. I, I have some great uh, questions prepared for you, but, um, but I forgot I'm at home, so we're going to go with some crappy questions. Okay. So, first wing, what is your favorite color? Oh, they're cold. Okay. Yeah, they are cold. They've been sitting out for a while. I could have microwaved them, but, uh, but um. I didn't, so... I think these are refrigerated, is what I feel like. I feel like these came out the refrigerator. No, I just been out. Oh, okay. Um, my favorite color would probably have to be, um, red. I have, like, a color combo trio that I like. There's not really a color combo, because black and white aren't colors or shades. But black, red, and white feel like they go so well together. Yeah. Yeah, this is, like... Like a new spin. This is barely mango. Like, I... Normally, this is supposed to be sweet. No, it's mango. This is not sweet. It tastes all mango. Do you think mangoes are spicy? That first one wasn't spicy. Well, this is mango habanero. And they definitely... Well, the, mangoes mangoes aren't spicy as a fruit, so... You're right, you're right. No, it's not spicy. I if, think, you're, if, you, if that's spicy for you, then there's something like... Yeah, I, I, you know what? We threw a low ball for the first one. That's actually off I the know. mild section. I, I've I've gone to several places and had like various spicy wings to test my palate. That is um an interesting combination of mango and habanero. That ratio was different. Okay. Definitely different. So you like my shirt then? Because my shirt's red. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I got the red shirt on. I like red too. I think red's my favorite color. Um, so. You're you're an art major, is that correct? My understanding. Well, for now. For now. Why? What are you? Or rather, I'm going into a different field of art. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I was in graphic design. I'm gonna switch over to so jewelry metals. So for art, mm -hmm. what what's your what's your take on like modern art? Like, do you think of someone, if someone like chewed up paint and then like spat it out on a thing? And it's worth like four million dollars. How how do you feel about that? And why don't you eat your wing and then give us your take on modern art? Modern art, honestly, garbage. I went to a museum recently. Like was about within the past like two years. In the modern art section, there's literally just uh, like a 10 foot by 8 foot um, canvas that just has like, it's like from red to yellow. That's like, that's just the, the ombre. And that was considered, you know, worthy enough to be in a museum. So very questionable. It's like, I make, I make things in the bathroom that I feel like can right. be just as good. Yeah, I know. And I've added things that I've made in the bathroom to those exhibits, and they, they were, they didn't like it. They were very, like, 
They did not. They did not appreciate it. And I was like, oh, you like that thing? That literally looks the same. And you yeah. like that thing? I mean, I put the two pictures together, and it was barely yeah. a difference. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah. That one. See that one? I feel like wasn't as hot as the first one. So that's why I'm a little. That's why I'm a really? little baffled. That is why I'm a little baffled. Well, it definitely was hotter than the first one, so... You're well, eating right to left, right? Right to left. Yeah, alright. Well, yeah. maybe maybe they'll all just get less and less spicy for you. I, I highly doubt that. I think that was a one-case thing. Yeah. You brought up... You just brought up... Um, we had to do a cut because he said something, but you brought up... <laughs> you brought up Thai... Um, like Thailand. So where uh, would you have to go? Like, if you could go, if you could travel anywhere in the world, and I think this is a question I might have said in the first one, but I don't really care. If you could travel anywhere in the world, all expenses paid, price is not a price, is not an issue. Where would you want to go for like a week? That is a tough one for me. Well, eat your wing and then see how tough it is. <laughs> I, I like want to wipe it on the thing, but I also don't want to. You can, and I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it to make you feel better. Here, we can we can both wipe some. That didn't help at all. Like that that didn't help at all. Yeah, no, these are lathered. They they used the they used the little paintbrush. They used the little dainty brush to put this these sauces on. I, no, I don't think they put sauce on this. I think they put chicken. They on put the sauce. chicken in the sauce. It's like a fry later, but just with a vat yeah. of sauce that they dip it in. Um. I'm like torn between Italy and Norway. Italy because I, I don't know much about my heritage, so I think just being around there and looking at the architect and stuff like that, and learning stuff about the culture would be interesting. Norway, because I mean, from what I've seen, just so beautiful. I'm like, you know, I've I've seen those just like. I've seen a lot of like flat land. It's just like natural. It's not like I'm in a city or anything like that. Maybe cool to visit. You're just taking bite. I'm eating the whole thing. Oh, what you are wrong with me. I well, typically we only eat the. We just like take a bite. I'll eat the whole thing. I didn't know that's what we were doing. Well, I also haven't eaten anything today. So. Me neither. Yeah, but I'm gonna get food after. This is not. This should not be what I'm eating. You know, I will hurt myself. Oh man, I'm just realizing that we're at the <laughs> we're at the second to last one. Yeah. So that one was about equal to the second one. How are you handling this? How are you doing over there? Um, I was expecting like my whole like throat and everything to be burning, and as I say that. It's now hitting my throat. Uh -huh. Yeah. So I think that was my fault. Oh man. Yeah. No. Uh, sinus is opening up. Tongue is on fire. <laughs> and the the air, the like as I'm breathing out. I mean, like the heart. The uh, God, it's making it worse. <laughs> yeah, breathing. It's just heat. Breathing does kind of make it worse. I just want to say this is the next one is like a challenge sauce from Buffalo Wild Wings, um, where uh, it's said like it's like the nine like spiciest peppers mixed into a sauce. Um, so I'm just letting you guys know like this we have the last dab of course coming up uh, later, um, but this itself is like like it's a lot it's a lot that's what I'm trying to get at um, so. Yeah, I'll do what they do on the show, where they talk about your accolades and stuff. So, not only are you an artist, but you are also an up-and-coming um, actor, um, in, and you've been in a few projects. Um, most notably, I think, oh, gosh. I think was I your appearance in Time Crunch. I knew it was going there. Yeah. You, you, played, uh, you played Professor Phil Sky in Time Crunch. Um, and uh, you did a job in that oh, yeah. um, acting. Oh, yeah. You did a good. You you really did play a character. You were <laughs> quite the character in that film. Yeah, I um, think I I think I was like. It, well, wait, because I think you might answer the question I'm going to ask yeah. you is so getting into character for that um, you know crazy mad scientist. I'd love to know 
and this is sort of a loaded question. Oh man, this is so this is slipping <laughs> off my fingers. That's so it's I'm... like, what what did you do to get into character? Is there any sort of anyone you know in real life? Maybe like, did you have a professor who was like kind of eclectic like that, or? Third part of the question is, was there maybe someone you've seen in pop culture, like any other movie, who, uh, who's sort of using its inspiration for your performance? I'm gonna, like, do what Squidward did, and you feel like that. <laughs> Yeah! You know, I think the eyebrows and mustache really just brought it out of me. Um, I mean, both of those things, I mean, were, this took over, you yeah. know? The, the costuming eye- for that movie was really good. The eyebrows gave me the emotional expression and the mustache, the sophistication. Um, you know, I think the little bit of me that, you know, came out was the, the, the accent I was, where, where did you come up with that accent? I was trying so hard to do like a... Uh, uh, like a silly, posh man. Like, you know when people are like really like rich and you know they do the... the <laughs> you know that kind of thing? Yeah. I think that's what I was going... Wow! <laughs> um, yeah, that's what I was going for. Wait, okay, I picked up another napkin. I should have just used this one. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be the... Yeah, I was gonna bring that up. sauce napkin. I was gonna bring that up. Maybe that'll be the title. Isaiah maintains his lap napkin while handling... <laughs> <laughs> oh my yeah. god, I'm not ready for this. I think we're handling it pretty well. No tears. Mm-mm. You know, this, this might bring me to tears yeah. or, or my sinuses will be so yeah. kicked oh. that, um, oh man, it's like my lip just keeps burning. That's what it is for me. I think I'm lucky enough that it didn't hit my lips, yeah. but my entire tongue, all of it. I just oh, have a bad habit yeah. of like licking my lips. So it's like, just keep sitting there. Oh man, <laughs> that's that's bad. That is okay. Something's tempting in my mind to finish this plate. I don't want to leave like anything on here, but um, I'll do that off camera. You know, um, or maybe on camera. Maybe maybe I'll surprise you guys. Listen, I I'm sorry. I feel bad because I'm not doing that. So. And I know the name of the game is, as the host, I'm supposed to be matching you, but I just think that's really stupid, so I'm not going to do it. Alright. Well, that's what they do on the show. They shake it. That's what they do on the show. He shakes it, and he goes, well, alright, my friend, you've made it to the last wing here. The last dab, and it is the last dab. It's the Apollo last dab. This is the updated one. The first top few we did, we had uh, just the regular last dab, but now we have Apollo. This is the new one they've been using. Um, so, yeah, we're going to just put a little bit on here. And uh, be very careful with this because somebody... Oh, oh, I'm not putting it on top. Put it on the side and dab it in. No, uh, that's not how they do it. That's not how they do it. Mm-hmm. I mean, they, I'm sure they've done it in some. I've... I've I think they have two, but this is just how we play. It. Okay, you know what? Fine, fine. I'll play. Here in Hot I'll play few, here in Hot Few, we do things a little different. You know, I'm Hot Few with fewer options. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. You could, you could, you could definitely poison some of your constituents with this. All right. All right. I don't know. I was gonna fully cap it. <sighs> Oh man, I smelled. I did not fully uh just get a good mixture in there, you know. And then, hold on, you do this. Just get it, make sure it gets to the end. Yeah, don't 
Don't get it on the cap, though, because I don't want it to be nice. Well, that's, fine. that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I just... That first bottle we had just kind of got kind of messy. That's why I... This one is a new bottle. This one I'm going to try to keep. I'm going to try to maintain it, you know, nice and... Yeah, I see, I see the little... Little, uh, you know... Yeah. Being pushed out. All right, like, how... You, you, I want you to tell me where to stop. Uh, that's probably even that. Are you serious? Okay, One little drop. Go a little. I look, man. I mean, listen. You know better than I do. I don't put another. Put another drop about that size. I'd say only because it's blazing. I put oh, like that. You mean I, I guess that's fair. Right? I put three of what you just okay. Did, so basically. then I'll do two. I'll do two. Um, you know, because uh, you really it, that. I mean, you really only need a a little. Come on. Because it's it. And that's exactly what I was trying to avoid, but <laughs> you know it wasn't coming out. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, you know what? It's fine. You know, it's fine. It's fine because yeah. I can, I uh -huh. can, I can just. You can. Um, you know what? Oh, you know. There you go. Yeah, it's probably just a that's little. Right, yeah, right. there, there we go. That's two. Okay, so the question. This is our famous hot few last question that we always ask. Because we're all the show, you know, this is SSU TV, Southern Connecticut State University, so we are all well-educated um, um, college students here, so you, we've seen a lot with a lot with our experience. So, if you could give any advice to uh, people who are graduating high school, incoming college students, not, not specifically at Southern, just advice that any new college student could, could use. What, what, what would you give them? What would you tell them? Okay. Where's my bike? That's a good bike. That's a good bike. Um, I would say... Take some time. As someone who... I, uh... I went in to Southern declaring my major immediately with computer science. <laughs> and, um, you know, it's not what I'm doing now. I changed my major, like, two years after wasting a good amount of classes. I ended up going into uh, graphic design, and even now, I'm switching my major again. So you never know what you're going to get into while you're here. You never know what you're going to find and what you're going to actually like. You know, so if you're one of those people that know exactly what you want to do, by all means, go for it. But if you really don't know, <clears throat> don't be afraid to be not uh, non-declared. Figure yourself out. Yeah. As I try to figure out how the heck I'm going to beat this. I was just going to bring that up. How are you figuring Oh man, that sauce? I don't know if it's this. Or if or it's blazing. Or with the combination of the two. It's not bad. Like, the burn is there. But the flavor... <laughs> no, it's good! That's my whole point is with like, this. You know, I always would be like... I'd call BS on uh, some people saying like, Oh yeah, it's got flavor, blah blah blah. I'm like, no, that's gotta be pure heat, but... <laughs> this is like pure heat, but with some... With some stuff working itself in there. Pure Heat is a good band name. Pure Heat, yeah. That'd be a rockin' band name. That one's free. Up and coming musicians. Pure yeah. Heat. Or or lap napkin. Lap, lap napkin. Lap napkin. Yeah. We are lap napkin. Oh, that that that's that's good, dude. All right. Um. Oh well, you have made it. I yes. Through this little gauntlet here. I don't, know if, you, I don't here. know if you could call it making it. Well, you're. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we're here. We're alive. So, this camera, that camera, this camera, that camera. Why don't you tell our tens of dozens of viewers? Why don't you tell them where they can find you? What you got going on here in life? What What are you What are you up to, pal? Um, you can find me in a couple of SCSU TV uh, programs. You might see me in the future on a couple more of these. Not this. Um, but other projects. Not this, because we're doing another one in like an hour. You could come back. Oh, um. <laughs> I'm good. Oh. You know Sean Evans? He does like multiple of them a day. I know. I know. 
I don't know how you do it, pal. I don't. Either. Oh. And I lick my lips. There goes the... And it's like... Uh, I, I bite my lips, like the skin, and it's just seeping right in. Oh, There's yeah. no protection. Oh, yeah. No, it's bad. It's bad, dude. Oh, man. Well. It's just been a pleasure. An honor. And a privilege. Yes. I'm so glad that we got to do this again. Oh, yeah. Hot few round two. Uh, that's it for you. Except I think this might be the first one. So, there will be another two parts. Here at SCSU. Here at SCSU. Hot few round two. Yeah, that's good. That's good. We'll use that.